Hi friends, today I'm going to make a batch of two pounds of my batter, soap batter that I call suds and it is sandalwood. And you'll see I'm going to use a mold that only cost me 75 cents. It's a drawer organizer that I got from the Dollar Tree. I got it in a two pack for 125. And I don't line this mold I used to, but I don't need more. I found it sometimes just pops right out of the mold without a lining liner. And if it doesn't, I freeze it and then it pops right out. So that's pretty sweet. Saves time and money. Today, I'm just going to start from the point where I'm mixing up the colors instead of usual where I bring in the lye water and mix that up. So let's get started. So here I have an orange color. And I'm just going to mix it by hand, not stick blender, because I don't want it to thicken up on me. To do a tiger strike, you want your batter to be very fluid. And this is the batter with no nothing added. Get more of that than I need. Here is the brown. the green. So I'm going to alternate the stripes one on top of the other until this container is full. And I have a white heart to add when I get close to the top. back to cut my soap and I mentioned earlier that I would freeze that mold to get it out and I actually didn't have to do that all I had to do was kind of start to release this the soap from the mold and it came right out Now the topping was actually not intended to be white. I was at the same time as making this soap, making a uh, topping for my cakes. I'll have another video about the cakes I make. And then I didn't, didn't have enough batter to finish this, so I put some of the white on here. But I think it's pretty. It's a very winter look to it, to me. It's, Makes me think of snow. It's the top.
I hope that you enjoyed watching me make my tiger strip sandalwood soap today. And have a very good rest of the day today. And take care of yourself and all the people around you. I'll see you in the next video. Bye, everybody.